Hi, my name is Jackson Sullivan, and my science fair project for the Fort Bend ISD Science Fair is Heat Race, Exploring Metals Thermal Aptitudes. So, first, our question was, which metal conducts heat the best, or radiates heat the best, copper, steel, or aluminum? And our, my hypothesis was, if heat is applied to the metals, then copper will be the best conductor because because it has a higher thermal conductivity due to its atomic structure and composition. And so, the procedure we, uh, the materials we used, copper, aluminum, and steel, hollow rods. We also used a sharpie to mark two foot increments along each rod before heating them. And we used a temperature gun. We used the heating element, a level, car jacks, a timer, a camera, a computer, fire extinguisher, and we had a first aid kit, safety gloves and goggles included. Um, next, the procedure was set up three hollow rods, copper, aluminum, and steel, on jacks in a straight line using the level and adjusting the jacks with the level to make the rods level. Next, we marked equal distances along each of the rods with two foot increments. Then after that, we applied the heating element to the zero centimeter mark section of the first rod for a total of 10 minutes. We stopped it and recorded the temperature data for each of the metals at different intervals. And then we repeated steps three through five, which was apply heating element, wait 10 minutes and measure, and record data. For, and then repeat those steps for each rod. And we allow rods to cool for, before further handling. So, the raw data collection is here. You can see, and then here's the results. So this is the heat rate's results. This is the percentage change. So it starts at zero, and it per and so, contrary to the com uh, the hypothesis, um, aluminum actually conducted heat the best, while copper was the worst. So, <laughs> aluminum had a percentage change of about 500, 580% before it dropped down to almost negative 100% change. And then up here, we have the data results, so raw data. So we have the temperature readings on this side and Celsius degrees. And as you can see, the aluminum got up to 90 degrees Celsius, which is like 300 degrees, I'd like to say Fahrenheit. Um, and then before dropping down to about the starting. And steel, steel, uh, got to 70 degrees Celsius, while copper only got to about 30. So, the conclusion is the experiment revealed that aluminum exhibit exhibited the highest heat conductivity closest to the heat source, while steel demonstrated the farthest heat radiation along the rod's length. Contrary to the hypothesis, copper did not show the best heat conduction. Despite this, the findings align with the scientific properties of these metals, suggesting that their molecular structures and compositions affect their heat transfer abilities. The experiment also emphasizes the, uh, the significance of thermal conductivity and radiation in various metals. Something we could do to improve it is multiple trials. Maybe, maybe it would be, maybe it would just calculate and average them, slap it on there. But that's my project. Thank you for watching. Uh, see you next time. Bye.